Good evening. My name is Debbie Diggs and I'm the proud principal of North Fort Myers High School. Welcome to our virtual National Honor Society induction for 2020. The National Honor Society is the nation's premier organization established to recognize outstanding high school students. More than just an honor roll, NHS serves to recognize those students who have demonstrated excellence in the areas of scholarship, leadership, service, and character. These characteristics have been associated with membership in the organization since its beginning in 1921. Today, it is estimated that more than 1 million students participate in NHS activities. NHS chapters are found in all 50 states, the District of Columbia, Puerto Rico, many U.S. territories, and Canada. Chapter membership not only recognizes students for their accomplishments, but challenges them to develop further through active involvement in school activities and community service. Four main purposes have guided chapters of NHS from the beginning. To create enthusiasm for scholarship, to stimulate a desire to render service, to promote leadership, and to develop character in the students of secondary schools. These purposes also translate into the criteria used for membership selection in our chapter. At North, new members are tapped the last two years of high school. In addition to having a 3.5 unweighted grade point average, students must be considered to be of good character and be involved in multiple school and or community activities that involve service and leadership. A focus on scholarship, service, leadership, and character are only the beginning after becoming a member. We expect our members to excel academically, model initiative for improvement, and show service. Our North Fort Myers High School NHS members must maintain their strong GPA and are expected to attend multiple volunteer activities and fundraisers for both our school and community. Our current chapter proudly supports the Salvation Army, deployed troops, as well as various community projects each year. As I look at each one of our current and new members, it is with great pride. I understand the hard work and long hours each of you has put into become a part of this prestigious organization. I look at each one of you with confidence knowing how well you represent our school with the perfect blend of academics, service, leadership, and character. Your continued work ethic and values will take you far in your endeavors for continuous growth in your areas of study and profession of choice. You represent the tradition, pride, and success of all that North Fort Myers High School has to offer. Congratulations and well done. Okay. Mrs. Diggs, parents and students, welcome to the December 18, 2020 National Honor Society induction ceremony. We are gathered here to formally recognize those students who have been selected by the faculty of our school for successfully completing their candidacy and now are being inducted as new members of our National Honor Society chapter. For current members and those former members who may be among our guests, we hope this will serve to remind you of the standards of excellence you too are charged with maintaining as members of the nation's largest, oldest, and most prestigious student recognition program. Our chapter is proud to have been inducting new members yearly, and with today's ceremony indicates the continuing emphasis on excellence that we represent for our school and our community. Throughout the year, members of our chapter serve as role models for other students. In addition to the strong academic records which establish the eligibility for members, our chapter members are leaders in many student organizations and we serve our school and community through many activities. We are proud of this record of accomplishment and welcome these new members who are bringing energy in support of our community and work as our new National Honor Society members. To present the qualities of our four pillars of National Honor Society, please welcome our chapter president, Lorelai Bungard. It is at this time that we proclaim to all in attendance that membership in the North Fort Myers High School chapter of the National Honor Society has been earned by these candidates through the effective demonstration of the four qualities that serve as standards for the society. Members of the chapter will now review these qualities for the candidates. We begin with scholarship presented by Sierra Simon.
Scholarship denotes a commitment to learning. A student is willing to spend hours in reading and study, knowing the lasting benefits of a cultivated mind. We should continue to learn even when formal education has ended, for human education ends only with the end of life. Knowledge is one great element in life which leads to the highest success, and it can be acquired in only one way, through diligence and effort. Learning furnishes the lamp by which we read the past, the torch guiding us to understand the present, and the light that illuminates the future. Candidates have the charge to continually expand their world through the opportunities inherent in scholarship. Now here is Abby Graff presenting Service. My office is service. Service can be established in the routine of the day's work where many opportunities arise to help others both at school and in the community. A willingness to work for the benefit of those in need without monetary compensation or public recognition is a quality we seek on our membership and promote for the entire student body. We are committed to volunteering our time and talents to the creation of a better tomorrow. Now Jordan Lindsay will present the next quality of leadership. Leadership should exert a wholesome influence on the school. In taking initiative in the classroom and in school activities, the real leader strives to train and aid others to reach their common goals of success. The price of leadership is sacrifice, the willingness to yield one's personal interests for the interest of others. A leader, a leader has self-confidence and will go forward when others hesitate. No matter what power and resources may exist in a school, community, or nation, they are ineffectual without the guidance of a wise leader. Leadership is always needed. Thus, to lead is a meaningful and substantive char charge to each of our members. Introducing Lorelei Bungard for the quality of character. Character is the force within the individual that distinguishes each person from others. It creates for each of us our individuality, our goodness. It is that without which no one can expect. It is, with, it is that without no one can respect oneself nor hope to attain the respect of others. It is this force of character that guides one through life and, once developed, grows steadily within. Character is achieved and not received. It is the product of constant thought and action, the daily striving to make the right choice. The problem of character is the problem of self-control. We must be in reality what we wish to appear to others, to be, to be rather than to seem. By demonstrating such qualities as respect, responsibility, trustworthiness, fairness, caring, and citizenship, we may hope to prove by example that we value character. Now for the presentation of new members. Caitlin Bonema, McKenna Brown, Emily Lizenby, Vanessa Sawarski, and Jenna Wagner. Please join me in reciting the pledge. I pledge to uphold the high purposes of National Honor Society, to which I've been selected, I will be true to the principles for which it stands and will maintain and encourage the high standards of scholarship, leadership, service, and character. This concludes our North Fort Myers National Honor Society induction ceremony. Thank you all and have a good evening.